Let's illustrate one more point, especially for the adults. So oftentimes this is too easy. Here we have 40, 2. And I want to take away 6. 40, 2. I'm going to take away 6. And as I said, with the magic of DVD, you can always roll back and watch this several times. But all I'm going to do, because I know that 6 needs to be a 10, or wants to be a 10, and what does 6 need? He needs a 4. So I would just add the 4 to the 2 to get 6, and then subtract. Right? But actually, we're adding. Now, for adults, they always want to see something. That, all right, so here. Here is 6. Now, the first question I ask is, do I have enough? Do I have enough? I don't have enough. I can't take it out of that 2. So oftentimes, we just remind ourselves that we don't have enough, that we're actually going to take it out of here. So what we're going to do, again, is take this 6 out of one of the 10s. Now, what does 6 need to be a 10? It needs a 4. And you can see a 4 would fit right there. And again, now I see that I have 6, because I just added 4 to the 2, and I have 3 left over. Done. That simple. No borrowing, no putting the 1 there and counting backwards from 12 or doing normal subtraction. We just add small numbers together. And of course, if I had some 10s over here, then I would take them from these 10s. It's that simple.